Hi, beauties and curls. It's Melissa Cute. Thanks so much for coming back. And out of all the YouTube universe, you decided to come and chit chat with your girl. Yes. And today's video is a review of the Maui Moisture Heal and Hydrate Shea Butter Hair Mask. And this is for dry damaged hair and also the hair oil. This is the raw oil. If you're interested in my thoughts for my high porosity, fine thin hair and these products, keep watching. Okay, so y'all know I am a deep conditioner. Y'all know I had to get that. And I also got the Maui Moisture, the raw oil. Now y'all know I do the lock method. So I wanted to get something that was, I was on vacation. I had a staycation and I didn't have any hair products and I was getting in the pool and I knew I wanted to afterwards redo my hair so I picked up these two I used a shampoo to get the chlorine out but then I went in with my deep conditioner and my oil I have high porosity fine thin hair and this was amazing for my hair these are like two of like my favorites from the drugstore of course I am gonna have to just come with my drugstore favorites in terms of hair care when it comes to my curly hair but y'all this I, it has a special place in my heart because the Maui Moisture Heal and Hydrate Hair Mask, y'all, I was able to use this not only for my, for deep conditioning, I could use this as a leave-in and it's so creamy. This is so good. It's so creamy and guess what, y'all? It's glycerin free. Now, I have gotten a, I, I've gotten requests from you guys to come with some glycerin free products. I'm definitely coming with that but this is gonna be in the mark. It smells so coconut and smells so good. But y'all, look how much. I have been killing this. I have been using this as a deep conditioner. I have been using this as a leave-in and I love it for both. This is silicone free. Both of these are. And they have, both of them have shea butter, coconut oil, and macadamia oil. I love this deep conditioner. It is so good. Let me show you guys the consistency. I, I started to do that before but it is super creamy it's almost like lotion like a body butter creamy like and it like dissolves it's it's not light but it's not heavy either like this is a good moisturizing leave-in like my leave-ins can't be too watery it has to be like thick because I wanted to coat the hair and I really, really, really enjoy this as a leave-in. I love this as a leave-in as much as I do a hair mask. So if you had to take one item with you traveling, this would be a duo item for me. Um, I really enjoy that. Let's talk about the oil. Now, deep condition first. And then I rinse that out. Yes, I do rinse it out. I rinse it out. I don't rinse all of it out though. And then I go in with this Heal and Hydrate Shea Butter Raw Oil. This is so good. It's so thin. I use this on my dry and wet hair. Y'all see, I have been killing it. And it smells so good. I love the, I actually really like the packaging. This is not going to last on here, but I really do like the packaging. It's very appealing. This makes me want to go into the other lines of the brand, but I got this from CVS2 for $14. So it was a really good, I feel like it was a really good, um, a really good deal. And I will tell you, this is like my favorite oil from the drugstore. Because it's super light, it's silicone free. The other ones I want to say from Organics and from some other brands have been like, they have dimethicones and different things. This is silicone free. I really do enjoy these. These are like my favorite. I know I keep talking about favorites from the drugstore, but these really, and really impressed me. I did not expect this to be a leave-in that I could use and for it to be glycerin free. It even gives instructions that you can use this as a leave-in. So I really, really do enjoy these two products. I hope you guys enjoyed this review of drugstore products. And yes, let me know over here in the poll. Let me know what you guys wanna see next. I already have next Texture Tuesday already set up. But let me know in the month of October what you guys would love to see. And yeah, go ahead and vote over here. I would love to hear your thoughts. So thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Please subscribe if you hadn't already and I'll see beautiful you in the next video. Bye loveys.